Oh, hi. You are big. Good readings, everybody, and welcome back to Daddy the Grand, the granddaddy place. Have a nice death. We could start with the this side in here again, huh? Would take a lot of damage, but I think I'm gonna do it. And I think I'm gonna do it mostly, because it's a pretty, pretty okay condition. I think this would mean that we get a free ability in here, so... That does sound pretty interesting, too. And what else is new? An anima? We could get a second this side. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. I'm not sure how that's gonna work, so I think I'm gonna refrain, because I also don't want to leave more maximum HP. We do have the option to reroll, so let's try that out. And uh, looks pretty, pretty good. Getting a Prismium in here on the house. Sure. I'm ready to go. Let's start. Got a huge chunk of damage. But we can heal that back up by just being amazing players. Is that right? I think we can pull that off. Now, let's get this party started. This side was pretty, pretty fun last time. So I'm feeling pretty okay having it again. It's not perfect. But it will do. Gotcha down. Got a huge pure heal. We're gonna drink it immediately. That's almost back to maximum. And yeah, I think our damage, at least for the moment, looks pretty, pretty banging. Got them, got you. And now you. Just killing all of them. And none of them is giving me solar reason yeah? Is that right? Is that it? Well, that's not cool. Solar Prismant Apartment, let's go there. Oh yeah, I just realized we also start with the spell. It is the Fireball, if I saw it correctly. The, the Fire Error is actually a Fire Error. Yeah, that's nice. We can just go and blast some enemies here and there, and that Anima is going to come into great use later down the pipeline. Of that, I am certain. And we have a little bit of a situation in here, huh? Oh, and it is quite a situation indeed. Got that. And now for you two ladies. And now for these ladies. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, you think you're the only one having annoying projectiles, huh? You are a fool, little lady. Got a curse reroll. That might come in handy later. Got my solaries. But I need more. I need way more than that. I need all the soloists in the world. And we have no more fight going on in here. Well, that's sad. <sighs> let's go for the... Let's go for the solo deposit again. Especially that we have one Prismium. I kind of feel like we want to have a decent amount of soloists in order to really buy ourselves something amazing. And maybe I should contemplate taking one of the... Solar related contracts next time we start running. Because I feel like having 50 or 100 starting solaries could give us a lot of good options for later stages of a given run. Oh. Let's take out these booklets in here. We did. Take out that booklet over there. We did. And we are done. That was an explanation mark over my name. I'm not sure what caused that. Still got the poisoning down in here. Costs quite a bit of mana, though. Get down at Mr. Osha. Hello, my friend. Extra spell damage. I think we're gonna take that. Because we do happen to have spells. And I think one of them is actually a double hit. So we benefit twice. That's okay. It is okay. Feels like missing a spear of injuries. Don't need that. Just in case we are going to need that later down the line. Gonna leave it there. I mean, it's like 11 damage from a safe distance. What's not to love about that? Got the lady, got another lady, and we win. Yeah, feeling pretty, pretty good about this run so far. Let's see how long we can keep this up. Got more solaries, putting us at... Almost a 90. And this is where we bit this floor are you. Team Osha yet again. He was already setting us up for what could end up being a great spell every run. So we can, full, we can fulfill this destiny. I will be all for it. I think the last one was already very heavy on the beast. 
But it only became that heavy towards the very end. Because we ended up picking up a few perks that really made a difference there. Really? Again? Again and again, you'll make me fight my female co-workers. Really making me look like the villain here, game. Just saying. Just saying. There we go. That's one more, of course. And that is... The Spitfire was actually very good. Spitfire was very, very cool. We're gonna pick that one up. It's going to serve us very, very nice later down the line. Now, obtain 30 solaries. Hmm, I'm gonna try. I kind of think I'm gonna reroll that. Spare Brigade, 5% damage upon casting. That is a huge one. That is a very, very huge one. And we gotta give ghosts more damage. I think we can stand that. Definitely not making the shops more costly. That sounds counterproductive. And we're gonna fight the janitor again. I also wanna go for the shop, though. But I think if we have an opportunity to fight Mr. Clean again, we should absolutely take it. It's still gonna be passed up on, isn't it? We're also bound to get some on, so we got Grand Palmer in here. By meeting T. Osha again. And if we have the opportunity to do so, we absolutely should take it. There's Mr. Killeen. What's he doing? Burning is what he's doing. And slamming you down. And the Spitfire is just absolutely destroying him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, the yeah, yeah, yes. That was very good. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna try... I'm not a big fan of any of these, I gotta say. I really am not. Let's take the extra maximum HP in here for the route. And hope and see that we will see something better in the foreseeable future. Roast them. Uh, we don't have any injuries to heal up, so leave it behind again. But do keep on picking up that item for me. It's actually a very, very good one. And now it is time for Mr. Bradley. I think we should be fine. The Spitfire has proven time and time again that it has insane damage potential here for us. There he is. There he goes. There he sits. And I just got another 37 followers on my inside death page because of the five times I crushed you. Boom. Oh, five times. That's already this many. Interesting. Make him burn to the ground. Can do it again. Let's do it right about here. Do it again. Do it one more time. I just realized how cheap this Spitfire is. It's actually kind of crazy. Easiest fight of my life. Well, your followers must be dying to know how you're feeling. Oh, please don't forget to like and uh, have a nice death, you clown. Oh, man. Roll credits. I think that's all we have to say about that one. Roll the credits. He said the thing. He said the name of the game. And Teosha is going to bless us with... I think I'm too, too excited, I have to say. Nothing I'm feeling all that good about. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. We're gonna take the Termination Mana Gains. That should allow us to just blast through some sections from here on out. But yeah, looking good. Almost full HP. We have two Animus to just start rolling with. On the cash machine over here. And maybe there's something within the fridge too. We don't need that healing over time. Not right now. Let's see. Are we lucky? That's a small healing. We're out. Could just use the anima instead, but... Yeah, sure. Some more solos. I think that's going to be it for the moment. I mean, solos, full HP. It's pretty much everything we would want out of animals, right? I think... I think it was okay. I think it was pretty, pretty okay. Alright, here we are. Looking for a roasting. These enemies are not that big, so we can't guarantee that they die in one hellfire. But maybe that is going to occur later down the line. Oh, sure. This early on yet again. That is a huge infusing. That's a huge infusion for magic 
base builds. I like it. Now we will be able to actually borderline spam our stuff and just absolutely ruin all of these enemies we are seeing here. That's good. That's great. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Easy money. Easy as money. I tanked that hit. Shouldn't have, but I did. And another golden anima. And that is a regular anima. So be it. Okay, let's go crazy in here. That is quite the firewall we create there. It's gonna be tricky to use properly, though. Oh, I forgot. If you use it in the air, you actually fire in both directions. That is probably gonna be the better way to play this, right? I might as well pick it up, I guess. Oh. Burnt him to the ground. The small rock throwers, man, they are a little bit awkward to play around, but we're doing just fine here. Prismium deposit. Maybe we can actually get a full upgrade on the Hellfire. Wouldn't that be something? I don't know. I think I ever did that before. I do vaguely remember having tried to do so, but I do not know if I ended up succeeding in the end. Shouldn't you be burning to death right now? Thank you very much. Like that. And he's so small, actually, was firing right over his head. That's silly. Got them both with a nice double kill in here. Oh. Burn him. Okay, it seems like using this attack in the air is also just dealing more damage in general. But it doesn't last as long. I see. Okay. More maximum HP. Gratefully. Most gratefully accepted. And there should be items waiting for me left and right. The Revelation Bow. I love the Revelation Bow. Yes, sir, I do. I like it more than the Poison Gift, I think. But the Poison Gift does have a place in this run because it helps us keep our spell-related stuff active. So you know what? I'm gonna say no to the bow for today. But it is a no thank you. And that thank you is heartfelt. Burn him. Burn him. Burn him. I wonder if we can get some more damage in here. That would be nice. Alright. Control room. Let's go. Let's go. Early control room. We gotta be so strong in here. Da -da 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 -da. We have easy enough resources to upgrade one weapon completely. Okay, so this bit fire. Burn duration increased. Don't think that's that good, but the damage most certainly is. Could also go for some upgrades on our scythe, I think. Hmm. And we could also get the umbrella in here, which I would be very interested in, but I think not at the moment. So, first of all, spend solaris on this. Would give it even more damage and even higher duration, I see. Spend some solaris on this too. Now, more solaris for this. Okay, the final update is not that good, but you know what? We're gonna take it anyway, because we can! Yeah, that's right, because we can. Because we can. I'm gonna save that one Prismium for later, I think. Oh, no, but let's actually spend it for the Umbrella. We haven't had the Umbrella in quite a while. Let's go crazy with that. And RJ Baron. That is a new Thanator we have not seen yet. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. And maybe even exciting. I have high hopes for this fight. Let's go. Let's see. Where is he? Oh, hi. You are big. Oh, he, oh, he is really, really weighing in there. I can tell. Where did that fist come from? Ow. Oh, man. These new Thanagers are no joke. They really, really are no joke. But we defeated him somehow. Oh, that was a rough fight. That's for sure. The guy did not look the way I thought he would, by the way. He looked vastly, vastly different. Um, gain retain. For a little extra damage. Also some more scythe damage. I mean, I guess. Sure. Seemed to be the best option in here. And yeah, the Hellfire. Actually doing great here for us right now. But it can be even better, I think. I hope. 
only time can tell. Not getting rocked by you, but I'm gonna rock your world, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh man, I gotta say that, 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 that was not going the way I thought it would. He was a heavyweight champion, that's for sure. But I think we unlocked something for having defeated him. We're gonna see after this run. Nope. Oh man, one-shotting these huge enemies is so good, though. Couldn't quite reach him with that. Thanks to us having the Umbrella, we're actually gonna take a lot less damage from Yano because of all the defense that provides us with. And that's good. Let's go crazy. Oh yes, I control the water and I control the fire. The world belongs to me. I think World Dagger was bad. It's kinda weird to use. It's kinda kinda weird to use, so we're gonna leave it behind. And keep on moving forward. Or upwards in this case. And give all of our enemies the roasting they deserve, only so we can say hey to Mr. Ocean here one more time. Hmm. 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 I'm not sure I feel about this, but actually this one sounds like it could be pretty, pretty nice. But there's also this one. We are already gonna be very tanky, so increasing our tankiness with this is gonna be even better. Ghosts cannot breathe even more fire. Let them. Do I look like I'm afraid? I'm not. I am very much not afraid right now. Let's go fight Mr. Grimes. Mr. Grimes is gonna get destroyed by the Spitfire. That is a daddy de grand promise right then and there. Mr. Grimes is not going to know what's going to hit him. Get some casts in there. Bruh. Oh, Grimey, you're gonna burn to death. Don't say anything. I know you weren't expecting to see me here today. You're imagining yourself a CEO at the top of your industrial tower, polluting until the end times, am I right? Yeah, first course of action, I'm going to incinerate you. Very fun of you to say that, buddy. Very, very fun of you indeed. Oh, okay, that was a good fisting. That was a great fisting you just gave me there. But I'm gonna keep coming. Phase transition acquired. He's still burning. Ever so slightly. And down he goes. Got one hit and do the zombie play. I don't mind. Well, who doesn't dream of taking your place, right? I dream of fresh air, Gordon. And you're the one preventing it. There's nothing to discuss. Oh, I should get me some fresh air later down the line, too. That being said, we win in this life. Termination gives extra defense, huh? If there would be more boss fights where we would actually have to fight against ads and enemies, I feel like that could be a lot more interesting. Not a biggest fan of most of these options in here, but we do use our Fury attack for a lot of burst most of the time, so I think that's gonna work. And even more so, is finding the way to me. So far, so good. Got a lot of soul reason in hand again, so I'm looking forward to spend them. And we have one blue anima that we can just drop in the machine one more time. What's it gonna be? A golden anima. That's a good deal. Gonna consume one, pick the other one up, and then we're gonna keep on a moving. So far, so good. Now, almost to the third floor, where Cranky is already awaiting me. Don't think Cranky got any new Thanagers. But I might be wrong. Though I'd be surprised if I was. Big and long-lasting firewall. Oh, he exploded. Exploded. I actually was not mindful of that because I was so impressed by seeing my own firewall. Okay, let's get down here first. Get these guys out of here. Get these guys out of here. Burn, baby. Gotcha. Easy fight, easy night. I actually have no idea what that item did for me. But screw it, we have it anyway. Boom. Oh, the hitbox on that one is very, very peculiar. You would think I was hitting him, but clearly I was not. Oh, hi. He got me. 
He got me really, really good. But I'm gonna keep coming back and hitting back as well. He should be dead, he should be dead, he is dead, he is dead too. And another one. Let's get down in here. Try to bite hot air. I was not smart, buddy. I was very, very unsmart. Don't get blown up. Good. Should be reaching the end in here soon. There we go. And we get D King Dengi. That fight does worry me a little bit. A slightly tiny, weensy bit. But we should be fine. As long as we play this smart and carefully. Which we can do. Every now and then. If we really put our hat behind it. Now. Hello there. Oh, he got destroyed. Yeah, Spitfire's kind of cute, I have to say. It's kind of, kind of nice. But probably not what I would consider a top tier ability. But pretty, pretty nice. Got him with that. Burnt him. Burnt him really, really good. Oh. Almost got burned on myself. Still burning, still blasting. I'm not committed to keeping the poison gift around. I hope we're gonna see another ability that is going to give us a bit more quality. Okay, Danzel. Let's see what you got. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! He got me. And he's dashing. Quite dashing. Still dashing. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go for the rainy day. He's almost dead. He's not quite dead yet. But we can change that right about now. See you around, Danzel. Now, what's it going to be? Hmm. Infuse poison, just on everything we do and have, huh? I think that would not be the worst choice of action. It would also make me feel a lot better about just letting go of the poison gift. It's a little free damage. Nothing to hate there. Nothing. Equipment storage in the Vita Mana department. Let's go for that. Let's see what we can find in there. Maybe some extra maximum HP would be nice. Extra mana probably wouldn't also be the worst. But I think mana-wise we are pretty, pretty much set. Tiosha! You are not what I expected to see in here, but I do appreciate it. Now these are all not that good. I don't think we really need to make the burn effect last long. I don't think we have a lot to gain from that. But having more defense, that does bring a smile to my face. Now, petrols gain more damage. I don't think we're gonna see them all that much from here now, so sure. Let them have that. Let them have it. We are going to be A-OK. -okay. This run is ending up becoming a lot more defensive in nature than I thought it would be. That was very good lifesteal, though. Very good lifesteal that we can now use to heal ourselves back to full. And we don't need to cause injuries in here. And there we go. Convenient. Very convenient. Oh, hi. Yeah, the hitbox on that was just not working in my favor. Oh, no. Ooh, if he would have gone for the combo strikes, I would have died then and there, but I did not. I did not. I'm gonna stay alive forever. Forever, ever. Good stuff. Got another golden armor for later. And he tried to bite me. The only thing he's going to bite is the dust. That's what he's gonna do. Easy fight, easy night. Another golden anima. Yeah, the hitbox on this one. It is so much smaller than it looks. And that does cause a few problems here and there. But we're fine in here. 
for the most part. More? Oh yes, there's more. Making it rain. I love the picture of Death just holding up the umbrella and looking at the camera. That always gives me some awkward sense of happiness. More mana, thank you. And there's our exit. More stories, more prismiums. Next time we're gonna see a control. We can just go and upgrade our umbrella even further. More damage, more defense, more good. Gotcha. Got him too. Easy. And now it is you. I'm not actually sure if we really, really have all that much extra damage. There we go. Oh, there's a petroleum, but he died very fast. I'm not really sure if we really benefit from using the Hellfire all that much in comparison to our regular Umbrella attack. But it is definitely a lot of fun to do. Just burning everything inside. The Raparia. We had that one before, but I honestly don't remember if it was any good or not. I'm also not sure if we ever upgraded it completely. So, for the sake of science, we're gonna see. Damage on the first level, of course, seems pretty, pretty bad already as it is. But who knows what can happen later down the line. I don't think I'm gonna go up in there. I think this is gonna be the way out. Am I right? Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Am I right? Oh yes, quite a few dots sticking on him there. They actually killed. Good stuff. We Burn, baby. Burn, baby. Good stuff. Still don't know what that item does. But we do see it quite a bit. There's our reward. And there's our exit. Alright, Cranky. He's also a pretty, pretty big boss, so I expect us to deal some honest to god good damage here. Da -da 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 -da. Decent set of solar recent here as well, so we should be fine. Doom. Ready to go, buddy. Ah, finally, a weapon worthy of truly settling the score. Rapier versus Pinsa. You'll see who lays down the law around here. Oh, he's actually reacting to the weapons I carry around. I thought the beeline from last time was just random, but apparently it is not. <sighs> On guard, I guess, as the fancy people say. Oh, we're gonna be very, very fancy, and here's what we're gonna do. Oh, you. I thought the line last time was just... Oh, he's dead. He's very, very dead. I thought the line last one was just a funny coincidence because everybody's like, hey, save the bees. What a bit of defeat. Impossible. I'll never survive such a disgrace. It might be funny, but we're in always the same story. Yeah, you hear that, Cranky? Maybe you should learn fencing. Oh, well, what's it gonna be? What is it going to be? Poison deals expert damage. I mean, we do have poison. Hmm, there's also extra scythe damage and retrain, which is not bad by any means. On the contrary, it's pretty, pretty good. Hmm. How much HP do we have? Up to 80, so 7% of that. It would not be too bad. That actually would be pretty, pretty good extra damage we would get out of this. For everything, which is the main kick on here. Ah. I think we have to take this one. Especially if we end up getting more max HP, it's gonna serve us nicely. Alright, here we go again. Onwards to the fourth floor where Maxi already waits for us. So we should not keep him waiting for too long. Osh over here, talking to the hot air. And we're gonna... I did not want to use that. I did not want to use that. I wanted to put it in the machine. Let's put this one in there then. Because I wanted to play this at least once. And we got some soldiers out of it. I got scammed. I scammed myself, rather. Sad. But that's fine. It's fine. It's good. It's fine. We're gonna keep on moving forward. Where, hopefully, dreams and destiny and victory awaits. So far, so good. Maybe the 100% extra poison damage wouldn't have been too bad, either. Maybe another time. 
Got a heal. I guess that's nice. And we actually have to be careful around these guys because they have more damage. And apparently they have more fire. I think those are the extra difficulty settings that we bought earlier. So, take care of not dying sudden gruesome deaths. Now for you, buddy. Oh. Getting hammered in here, but not today and not like that. And you just vanished. Makeshift rocket. No interest in that one. We already had that one before. It's pretty okay. But I think we have bigger fish to fry. There's a lot of bleeding related stuff. But we don't have any bleedings in here, I think. Oh, deal plus 10 damage per enemy. That's a huge one. That is a very huge one. Alrighty then, alrighty. Smokers spread white hot ash. I don't think I've ever seen that effect, but I want to see it in action. Oh, we're going to deal so much damage from here on out. With everything we do and represent. That's beautiful. That was just flat out 20 damage on everything we do. So good. Didn't need that heal, but I appreciate it anyway. Oh, he got punched in the face. There you go. There you go. Oh, wow. Okay, that attack looks awkward. That attack does look a little bit awkward. That's going to be okay. It's gonna be alright. Got quite a bit of feeling back there. And we can hit him there where he stands. And he died to the dust. Beautiful. Let's keep this level of performance up for as long as we can. Relaxation area. I think I would rather go to the Vita Mana department because if there's a chance for us to get more maximum HP, that would also mean extra damage. At least some extra damage. At least a tiny bit extra damage, right? Oh yeah, the shop though. If we can use the souls we have to buy a huge chunk of extra HP. That would be pretty, pretty nice now, wouldn't it be? He's just swinging his hammer around. We do not mind that. There's another anima. Good stuff. That just means that we are going to hit even harder, is what that means. I feel like they are a little bit more resistant to stun as well. Maybe that's my imagination. But that is most certainly how I feel about this. Let's go make it rain. We did, and it was good. And they're all down. Man, the rain effect. So good. Rutamama. No reason for that. No want, no need. Oh. I also felt like that one time that guy was attacking me, his hitbox felt kind of weird. It seems to be a little bit bigger than it looks. And it already looks pretty, pretty big, might I tell you. Candace, huh? Of course we're gonna go fight Candace. Because of course we're gonna go fight Candace. What kind of players would we be if we were to skip out bosses? I mean, there's plenty of reason why you would want to do that at some point. And I have do that. I've been doing that in quite a few situations here and there. But that is for later. Typically gain life steal? Sure. That gave me back a little bit of healing there. That's neat. And we still have to move forward in here. Forward, forward, up in here. Easy killings. Let's hope that we're not gonna take too much damage against sweet Candace in here. She's burning, but she's gonna do that. We know that. We know her so well now. Oh, she dropped straight in on the fight, didn't she? Oh, she's dead. She's gonna burn to death. Easiest fight of my life. Work like a charm. Okay, what do we get in here? Long lasting burns. We don't care for that, I'm afraid. This is pretty, pretty good. But I think... This is very, very good. But I think we're gonna go for the extra poison damage in here. Have some fun with it. We do have the poison fusion. Why not? Oh, you. Okay, that worked out like a charm. That stun was very, very good for us. It was most appreciated. Get down in here. I see ya. I see ya. 
Ooh, that looked like it could have fit me. Right where it hurts. Oh, there's a lot of them. I saw an 8 poison damage tick there. I guess that's okay. I guess that's okay. And we keep on moving forward in here. See where it leads us. Over 500 soul. We saw a shop or control room. Neither shop nor control room. But a solely prism department. Could also be good. With this many soulies on hand, the world is our oyster. And we are going to make the most of it. Hi there, buddies. Oh, look at that. That's almost 300 damage per hellfire. Yep. That's how we do it. That's how we do it, buddies. There's a small here, but we don't need it. Might be good to remember that it exists there, though. Ooh. Burn them all to a crisp. We did. Down he goes. Down they go. And uh, now it's only you and me, huh? Oh man, the hitbox on that one is so frustrating. He's still alive. He's taking eight damage per tick. That's not much. But it's pretty, pretty okay. Shockwave. We have no reason for that one. I'm actually not sure. Have we ever fully upgraded Shockwave before? I am. You know what? We're gonna take Shockwave up. Just because that is actually making me curious. Maybe Shockwave fully upgraded is actually amazing. Who knows? Ah, we got a Prismium. Very good. So, what's it gonna be? Shop or control room? Control room or shop? Or both? It is both! It is both. Okay, I think... I was talking about how I wanted to see the shockwave being a little bit more upgraded. But I think we're actually gonna benefit more from seeing the shop here. Buying us extra mana and, even better, more HP would be amazing. And we have a lot of buying power in here. Let's see, Maddie. What do you have? What do you have? Extra mana and an anima. Okay, first of all, we're gonna use the... I want to use the golden anima, thank you very much. We're gonna buy the mana, we're gonna buy the anima, and then we're gonna use our prismium. We got the slaymore. Pure heal for all the stuff. We got another prismium in here for later. And we can get the Osha giving us another curse, yes. These are not that good, though. Guess we take the extra burn duration then. Who knows what that might be worth it. And then we're gonna use this Prismium in here as uh, well. And we can buy another one for later. Can buy even more mana. Can buy more anima charges. We don't want the explosion, though. Sacrifix is broken. Sacrifix right here it is. This is buying a one game. We're not gonna do that, though. Give me the Prismium. Thank you very much. I think we could take the extra mana on the house. Also gonna buy at least one of these animas in here. Take it. Oh, there's the max- there's a max shop- I didn't know. I didn't know there's a maximum shop level in here. I did not know. I did not. Oh, that's sad, <laughs> actually. But it's fine, let's keep moving then. And go fight Maxi. I mean, it's good, right? It is good that we now know that. There's a maximum shop level, so you can only do so much with your Prismians in that shop. Alright there, Maxi. I hope you're ready to be burned down. 26% of workers have not realized their projects. Throwing out random statistics doesn't make you any more credible. Are they actually random, though? Let's make it rain here. I'm actually not sure if Max is really, really this random, because sometimes I feel like he might be one of the few people in here that is actually diligent. How does it not hit him? How did that not hit him? I call garbage on that. More bullets. And there he goes again. We can't hit him with that! Oh no, that's nasty. What's he doing? Oh, there's a new move. That we do know. That hurts. That hurts. But we don't take that much damage from it. Oh, that's nasty to the highest degree. 
Poison stack still. They are going in there. They're doing the thing. Okay, if we find the proper jump height. There you go. There you go. Oh, there's hands. He's throwing hands with me. Oh, that is bad news. That is bad news. Not bad news that are, you know, gonna kill us or anything like that. But it does feel pretty, pretty bad. He's biting me. He's biting me. He's biting me. He's biting me. He's biting me for all the damage. Okay, we got good stuff done there, though. That hurts. Oh, man. This fight ended up being bad for all the wrong reasons. But we can make it rain again. It's gonna end him. Is it gonna end him? I hope it's gonna end him. Yeah, it did end him. Oh, that was bad. That was very bad. The Chief Executor's Office of Death Incorporated is 88% tired. Now that, on the other hand, is a bit more like it. Oh, that was dur That was very, very rough. We have to use all of our animus in here to get back to full HP. Well, not even close to full HP, but let's bear with it. Um, mm, 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 mm. I don't think any of these are really all that interesting for us, but might as well take this one. More mana region. Oh, see, see what I mean about the hitbox on the Hellfire being very awkward? We were just not hitting him at all. That was bad. That was very bad. But we're still in here. And hopefully not just to suffer. I mean, it was 10% price for 10 minutes. It's hilarious. Um, I mean, we might as well take it. If not now, then when? Doesn't apply to this one, sadly. Let's see. Maybe we can jumpstart getting a huge chunk of animus here. <laughs> ah, it's starting. It's beginning. Uh, that's sad, though. That's sad. We're gonna leave it at that, I think. We're gonna leave it at that. Maybe I should have just taken the two animals and left it at that. But I was greedy. The greed got the better of me. Cardinal Sin. But that's okay. We're still going to win. I think. I hope. Trying to fire rockets at me. Got the crows everywhere. Ah, we got shot down. The crows, huh? Okay, that's actually where Shockwave might be great for. To just mass destroy these fools. Got them. And burned him down. Okay, so I think small enemies, we're gonna have a pretty, pretty decent time. Stunning with a shockwave, if nothing else. Oh, yeah, let's make it rain here again. Easy fight, easy night. Not quite. That guy tried to burn me down, which is quite ironic considering how they ended up going out in here. And that is the Sis word. We don't want that. We don't need that. Not at all. Boom. That worked. Boom. That worked. And this guy is pretty big, so he's gonna burn down with ease. I don't think I've ever realized that, but the shockwave noise is very satisfying. Oh, hi. Oh. Fire, no fire in here. I said no fire in here. These guys. These guys. They don't listen. Boom. I actually feel kind of sad for knocking these girls out like this. But we're still in here and we're still doing the things. And it is going just great. Now... Where do we go from here? Oh, hi! Got her. Oh, wow! That damage, though! Don't think that item is gonna do anything for me, but sure, whatever. See ya. Get out before we get blasted. We did, and we're gonna keep on moving on. 
through another shop. We still have a lot of souris. So, of course, we're gonna go spend them. More HP, maybe some anima, some healing. There's a lot of potential here to make us strong and powerful again. We are going to seize it all. Let's see. Dark Claws is a very, very good one. Concealed Carry. Take a gamble to win a weapon of your dreams. Arabica for maximum HP, that's huge. Healing Orb, yes. We don't want the Kaze Kunai. Kinda wanna play this one in here just to see what we're gonna get out of it. I'm not sure what happened. Nothing happened. Okay, fine, whatever. Maybe it only gives you a... It did, something did happen. It replaced the shockwave we had before with that other thing. Interesting. Probably not good, but interesting. It is not good that it just replaces them at random. But I mean, sure. As long as we still have the more important thing. All is good. Oh. Okay, that helps. That helps. Kind of felt bad about having the shockwave here. Gotta feel very good about seeing T. Ocean here. He gives me a huge chunk of extra defense, huh? Retaliation might also be good here, though. But I think we're gonna take the defense. I'm gonna. I think we're gonna take it. I think I'm gonna feel good about it too. Burn him to the crisp. Oh hi! I was not sure if I was actually safe there. That guy was crazy spins. And we are not done here just yet. We have to make it rain. Make it rain. Got them all. Got them. More? Oh, there's another one. Didn't see you, small crow guy. Don't fire! Please. Please. We don't have to go to war. Make love, not Warcraft. Gotcha. Gotcha. And we're still not done. There's a lot of crows coming our way. He's spitting the hot fire again. Oh no, mines! Oh! That could have been my downfall. One of them crows hit me. That is sad. And these crows just keep coming, huh? Okay, you need to stop, Cruz. How much damage did it even do? It looked like it was super, super tiny. We're done. We are done. We get the Dagus. Okay. Have I never had this before? Because this looks amazing. I feel like I've never had this before, but I do distinctly remember having seen that name. Now I have questions. No, I have several questions that I probably will never get answered. Fine, so be it. There is Camel Flash. I am ready for you, girly. It looks nice. That was not nice. That is very unnice. You are most unkind, girl. Could be high. Poison damage ticks there. 16, that's pretty good. Every time she jumps through the fire, it hurts her. Almost done. Gotcha. Ooh, it took quite the beating there. Well, it's actually not that bad. Now, what is it gonna be next? We sadly don't have any rerolls left in here. Sadly not. Ah, uh, these are all not that good. I kind of think we're going to take the anima healing here, because I got a hunch. I got a hunch that might end up being useful. We're not going to see a lot of imposters anymore. In fact, I don't think we're going to see any from here on out. But if we do, we'll be ready. Oh, hi. Good stun. And one more anima for the road. Gotcha down. One more animal for the road, making us strong and powerful yet again. And we got... The prisoner at this point is not really gonna do much for me, game. I have to say. And might buy us some ingots, though, so, you know, that's good. You are getting rewarded 
with points for having premiums in general, so I guess that's as good as it gets. Oh, you. Oh, you. Oh, you. Got the crow. Just gonna keep on running four real, real fast. Oh, no. Fighter jets. Oh, you. That's root to the ice degree. That hurts. A little bit. Good. Burnt him. Burnt him too. At least these guys are not super tanky. Use one anima. Then we can pick up the golden one for later. No fire. More souls that we are not going to get to spend. Sad, but it can't be helped. Oh. Gotta keep on moving forward. And there's another arena. Use some to go. Got him. Fire! I don't know why, but it's always so cute when they say that. I almost feel sad about killing them. But that is a huge, huge... Almost. And there's the Prismium. We were offered. Gonna leave these crows to the side. He's at fire again. Nothing in there. We get another Prismium. My god. Where were those? Much early into the run. Doesn't matter. We are ready for Mr. Plus Gun now. Oh, Mr. Plus Gun. Where are you gonna run to? Oh, Mr. Plus Gun. I am going to burn you. And I am also going to drown you. It's gonna be a rough time to be you. That is a promise. Huh. Uh -huh. These Bombara employees are becoming a joke. Must issue a response immediately. Ready, weapons! <sighs> I must admit, insolent children aren't really my thing. Yeah, those girls that dropped the mines, they're actually children. Good damage being dealt in here. And the poison, you know what? Actually doing God's work in here for us. And I like it. He's burning, he's still burning. Oh, what? Okay, I, I, I can't understand the second one, but the first one? That was a little too weird for me. My man tries to knife me. That did not work out for you now, did it? White flag, white flag! Aha, now that's a strong cup of coffee. White flag. <laughs> He challenges me, then he asks for favors. I can't help but laugh. This is actually a war crime he's committing right now, right? He surrendered, he has risen the white flag. But then he still goes to arms and blows everything up. Aside from all of us dying here, that's a war crime. I know a lot of media like to do that stuff. I think Star Wars is doing it all the time in the Clone Wars. But I'm very sure this goes against Warlord. Though I'm not an expert. I might be wrong. But I think I'm not. I think I'm quite right on that front. One way or another, we won another one. It was a very fun run too. Umbrella of the Hellfire. The Hellfire being awkwardly troublesome in the weirdest cases. But incredibly helpful in plenty others. And our performance review is looking pretty, pretty good. We're getting a lot of ingots for all of this. Now, we have defeated a new boss, the Baron. And we're gonna see if there's gonna be some kind of great reward waiting for us in that regard. I certainly hope so. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Hi there, buddy. Okay, we get a new contract in here. And we still have to use a lot of animals, kill a lot of roasters, and die a lot of times. Well, we're gonna get there, too. A ravenous spell that brings all your employees to the table. Interesting. We're gonna buy it. It's a new spell, so of course we're gonna buy it. And with that, I think... It's gonna be all for the moment, huh? Yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video, but until then, have the greatest of days, and please do stay as awesome as you are.